What's going on guys? This is a bit of a rush, if I'm honest. Last moment thinking, M is gonna go and play football and I'm gonna go and sit along the sides. I've not done this in a long while. I've definitely not done this with the 7180, well at least I don't remember doing it. Um, but yeah, she's got a football tournament, something different, something new from basketball, photography. Yeah, let's get into it. Let me take the friction from your life. When I'm alive. You all right? Okay, you, you wouldn't happen to be organising the event, would you? Yeah. Hiya. Uh, um, my partner's Emily. She just run in. You wouldn't have it, any clue of what team she would be on, would you? I didn't see anyone. Just come in. <laughs> That's what fine. What would she look like? Um, there's, there's too many similarities. Would she be playing for an Ipswich team? Yes. And I believe number 10, wearing green. Oh, green. That narrows it down. So this is Henley. Henley? Henley or third? I think so. W would they all be playing on the same team or...? So, so they're all sitting down there. Oh, OK. Girl, so. That's fine. All right, thank you. No worries. All right. Right, so Emma's been located. I'm just going to find a spot now and start taking some photos. Let's go drag a bench, shall we? Yeah, maybe not. Might have to take a seat just here. Right, so everything else being the same. Minimum 640, I think. Yeah, let's get the ISO back down. Yeah, 100's all right. F28, bit of, a bit of blown out skies, but we'll see. I'll be up that shutter a tiny bit, actually. Whilst the sun's still out, the moment that you get into the shadows, it starts to darken up. Be useful if I put it on continuous high, wouldn't it? <laughs> oh, mate, just when I get set up. All right, what's up, man? This one here? Yeah, after this game. So you're just out of your waiting now? Mm -hmm. How long, how long, what are there, two games left now? Yeah, so I'll, so they'll play this game, then I'll play in here, then I'll play here, and then that picture, then it's home time. All right. But then do that for five minutes, I think. All right, right. Although not playing, doesn't stop us from getting some shots. You know, I really just see her on skates in AstroTurf. I think with football photography, you've got to be a lot more um, sticky. What I mean by that is with basketball, you can, you can afford to move around, whereas with football, because the ball moves more, Wait, no, actually, I don't know if that's entirely true. All I know is that it's harder to anticipate. Maybe it's because I don't play football. I'll tell you what, there is respect for anyone. Anyone who shoots without being behind something. Right now, I'm behind a cage and uh, yeah, I wouldn't feel comfortable the way they're shooting this ball and not having any kind of protection in front of me. I'm looking for shots with, with connection as well. So waiting until they've got possession for a couple of seconds. And then from there, when they're about to release, that's when I'm gonna aim to, aim to fire. How the hell did that happen, eh? Oh, 
Football is definitely a landscape photo type thing too. I don't, I don't think portraits quite work the same as what it does in basketball. This golden hour sun, I, I'm enjoying it. I'm liking it. <laughs> it's just clocked. They call it. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Balotelli Teletubbies, for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> oh, got him. Oh, I missed that. I missed it. Oh, this one's got a bit of skill on her. Oi. 2 0. Golden Hour Sun is starting to fade now, so I'm gonna drop down to 164 in a second. And then if I'm losing light again, then I just bump my ISO up. Decent, a bit of a scorcher. Oh, I hate that. It's not enough frames, man. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Guys, what I might do as well is change my shooting, um, sorry my focus area to wide. I do feel like I'm out of control that way. However, because I'm missing frames, this may save a couple. When you have your focus mode on wide and shoot with native lenses, generally speaking, you get a much higher frames per second readout. So let's give that a try. Problem is I'm probably gonna get more missed focus shots. the problem and that my guys is the problem with wide see if we can try and manual focus out of it there we go and go back into it and hope it doesn't do that again ladies i took a couple of photos if you want them then i'll send them across to you so if you tap it on your phone then it should um like scan it yeah, you can do, all that way. Sorry, I wasn't able to get all of you just because of the range, but... Thank you. No worries. Now, question for you football photographers or anyone who's done this before. If you've got someone in defense that you're trying to take photos of, I mean, I should probably be on that side, but it's kind of like, how, how do you explain it? You don't, you don't want them to really, oh, really, oh shit. Want them to really, want them to really, want them to really, want them to really. Tasty. Tasty. That shit is hurting. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's a hot one. She got up. Yeah, that's quick. I would have been out for a little minute. I've been down and out for a little while. Oh, 
all shine is that bull. Yeah, anyway, my point. Um, so if, you, if, you're, if you're taking photos of someone who's defending now, who are you looking at? You're taking photos of someone who's defending now. It's kind of like, you don't really want them to defend, do you? Because like you want the team to be successful. So it's like, I, I don't know. <laughs> Get yeah, well, someone literally just got here a second yeah, ago. Like? Are they, this way, they are. The black team is shooting this way. There we go. <laughs> Whoever's shooting this way is pissed. Yeah, guys, it, it definitely shoots faster and wide. Most definitely. Uh oh. Here you go. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh. Oh. Alright, so might need to be bumped up a little bit. Guys, a little tip for you as well. Um, if you're if you're shooting with the A7R4, uh, it's got it's got basically two optimal sensitivities. So what you want to do is, if you get to ISO 100, if you get to ISO 100 and uh, you're out of light, you need to raise the exposure. Go all the way up to 320, ISO 320, and just up your shutter. To, to compensate for it. The reason why you do that is because the cleanliness of the ISO at 100 and 320 are the cleanest ISOs that you can get on the A7R4. So instead of going up to 160, I mean, it doesn't matter if it's only going on Instagram, but just to give you a little bit of a, a tip in, in quality. Ooh, look like a takeout. Ooh. Ooh. M's out here taking girls into bloody cages. Calm down, Wolf. Let me get all the way down there. I'm jumping into APS-C mode just so I can get that extra reach. Not to say that I'm paying, so I'm using my eyes and forget to use the camera here, but yeah. <laughs> So making excuses. Get on with it. Oh, shit on it. <laughs> yeah, that was clean. That was clean break. Straight for the angles. So a little bit of background on M's M's old career. She used to be a striker. For, for Ipswich. She uh, took some time away from playing with Ipswich. And now she tried out being a defender. She enjoys it. That's what really is that where you're taking a penalty from. 
Really? That's too damn close. Manual focusing now, yeah? Oh. And accidentally went into water. What a shit. Oh. Oh, oh. Oh. Is that a penalty? <laughs> Decent. Unlucky, unlucky ladies. Oh, 
enjoyed this POV near the end I tried to stay quiet just so that I wasn't cramping anyone's style talking about cameras if you like this type of content be sure to let me know in the comments and I'll try and get myself around some more sports lastly make sure you hit that like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next upload peace